Hi everyone, so today I have, I don't even know what to call it, but <clears throat> it's like people have sent me gifts, a gift haul, I don't know, but people have sent me gifts which <sighs> blows my mind. I don't know how to express what I feel when I feel like First of all, I just want to say, like, doing this YouTube thing, I've loved it. I've loved every second of it. And it has only brought me such awesome things so far. I have got, been able to talk back and forth with, like, a lot of different people that I wouldn't necessarily be able, like, have a regular conversation with as far as, like, my general friends, um, even just on Facebook. Um, <clears throat> Different people have come back into my life, like someone who sent me one of these things now that I had known from childhood, uh, and I don't know, I just can't tell, and then people send me emails and stuff and just say that I encourage them to like step out of their box or that they tried something I suggested and they loved it. I cannot tell you guys how much that means to me to hear because it really makes me feel like I'm not just talking to myself and that it's worthwhile. Um, besides that, through YouTube, I have made some really great friends, and I don't want to go, like, too far into it, but, um, just this past week, uh, I've had to deal with some stuff with my, with some health issues with my dad, and, um, just coming, just some stuff with, um, cancer and stuff, and so, I've had a really hard week, and um, one of my friends here on YouTube, I mean, I talk about it all the time, but Cassie from Shades of Cassie, she is someone that I talk to a lot, and um, she has just, <clears throat> has just been a real support to me. Um, so I'm going to try not to cry, but what people have done and sent me, and they didn't send me these stuff because of things happening with my dad. Well, one thing was, but I mean, just the fact that people go out of their way to send you something because they know you would like it, it seriously blows my mind. And I'm not saying that I'm not like that, but, and I'm going to become more like that, but it's just that people have surprised me and I just, I am very appreciative. I have so much gratitude. So I just wanted to say that when I got this today from Cassie and her family, um, it's gorgeous. And look, you can use this to put brushes in when it's done. I mean, the mind of a makeup freak, but this is just the most beautiful bouquet. Um, Cassie's family sent that to me um, in thoughts and prayers for my dad, and I just really, really appreciate it. I cannot tell you how touching it was to me and my family, so thank you so much. Um, <clears throat> other things that were sent to me, I just wanted to show you because uh, I'm Sarah, and I mentioned her in my September favorite person, um, she had offered to... Well, she, I had said something about seeing a sweater on, that she wore, and she had gotten this sweater at Target, but she, she couldn't find it, like, she couldn't give me the link or whatever, and so she just randomly said on Twitter, like, what size are you, I'm gonna get you this, uh, like, they have it on clearance, like, I'm gonna get, get you this sweater, and I was like, what? No, you can't do that, but okay, I'm a large. So anyways... She sent me this sweater, which from Target has like a little heart or whatever. So cute. I wore it the other day. I absolutely love it. Thank you, Sarah. I'm like baffled that you would send me anything. It's just the, the kindest thing. And um, she sent it like with this super cute little Hello Kitty card or a card like with Hello Kitty stickers and like the box had like this little lipstick tape all over it and um, it had it was like wrapped up and then it had like confetti and I'm not gonna pull out any of that paper be because the confetti is like everywhere so 
it's like a big joke with my husband and I will find like these little stars and he's like more confetti if you if you could imagine because I didn't know it had confetti and then I'm like ripping it open and like confetti is just everywhere on our comforter it was really funny but anyways and she also sent me two little Sally girl eyeshadows they're like way over on the other side of the house so I'm not gonna go and get them but they were like um like a cream color and a brown color really pretty great transition colors I had never tried Sally girl makeup before and I believe you can get that at um Sally's beauty supply so um anyways I really liked that so that will be something that if I am there I will be checking out again Okay, <clears throat> speaking of Sarah, Sarah at Beauty Buzz Hub, she used to be Makeup by Sarah Sparkle on YouTube, but now she's just launching a new channel, um, Beauty Buzz Hub. So she also has the corresponding blog, um, Twitter, and everything, so that it's the same handle, Beauty Buzz Hub. And I will put it right here or link it down below. Anyways, Sarah... On, I was looking on her website and I was just like, oh, you got that Lorac thing. Like when they had the when Ulta had the 21 days of sales, they had these Lorac. Like I think you could get like four Lorac palettes. Anyways, um, she, I was like, oh, I missed out on that because I was on my no spending thing. Well, she said, well, let me send it to you because I'm not going to use all of them. Like. I'm just like, who does this? Who is this nice? Well, people are. So, I mean, am I, like, not a nice person? Maybe I'm not. I, I need to be, like, nicer because these people are so nice that... Anyway, so this was, like, one of them that came in the, like, thing, and it was, like, quads. This one is in navy and gray um, shades. So let me just swatch these two for you. Um, I saw... Melissa from Mel MPHS do a tutorial using these or no she didn't do a tutorial she was wearing an eye look using these and it made me be like woo that looks really good I wish I would have got so that. she was asking me if I had gotten <coughs> the EOS Alice in Wonderland set and I had seen it in my target but then it was like gone the next time I went back so she sent me these and it has blueberry Sweet Vanilla and Watermelon Wonderland. Super cute. So if you could find these, these would make great little stocking stuffers. Maybe I'll look for them again. But So she gave me these to try. Thank you, Sarah. And then she asked if I had tried Knock on Wood. Now I think she had bought it thinking she didn't have it, but she already had it. So this is from Wet n Wild, and it just has like purple shades. I do not own this one, but I love these Wet n Wild trios. So... I will be using that. And then she asked me if she could, if I had any of the Sally Hansen Gem Crush nails. Now, I don't, you can't even, like, do this justice, but this is just perfect. I'm going to do, like, a manicure on my nails um, with this, and I'm just going to do, like, one color on top and then put this just on the tips. I don't know. Super cute. So, and it's like a little mini and then she didn't say anything about this, but she went ahead and sent me L'Oreal Youth Code Day Lotion, the um, the Day Night, and then the Eye Serum. So I'm assuming she either likes this or it doesn't work for her, but holla, I'm excited. This is awesome. Like, I will be trying this stuff out. If any of you have tried this Youth Code stuff, let me know. Um, I'll, I will try it out and let you know. So, that's sweet. I can always use some stuff like that. I just ordered the Clarisonic Mia in the Sephora Friends and Family sale. I'm excited to get that. Everybody says how life-changing it is for their skin, so I'm really hoping that they're not telling lies. Again, Thank you, Sarah. I cannot believe your kindness and generosity. I am seriously really touched by the fact that anyone wants to even send me anything. Like, it seriously blows my mind. So thank you so much for being so sweet. And you just have no idea how much it meant to me, especially even with the timing of, like, getting the flowers today and then the pa all these packages like they all came on the same day so I was like in tears because it's just I've been sick and then the stuff going on with my family um it just really 
makes me feel good that no matter in the midst of all this, like there are such great people out there. So thank you. Um, okay. So the third thing I'm like super, I'm excited about the other stuff, but I'm like really excited because my friend Simone, um, we grew up together and lived in the same town and stuff. And when she, she moved to Australia, Australia I, with her husband and she was just contacting me saying like that I, she was glad I was making the videos and to like keep it up. Just the sweetest email. I'm not going to like go into all the details, but the kindest email at like thanking me for making videos and that she had pushed out of her box and like gotten some brighter lipstick and it worked for her. And so it was just like, those are the emails that I'm just like, Oh, and my friend Brianna always sends me emails like this of like what's worked for her. And I just love it. So I just have also, my friend Amber is always telling me, like, what worked for her. I mean, tons of people are doing it, but I, you guys have no idea how much it means to me. But anyways, I'm, like, off topic. But Simone contacted me and said that she would love to send me some Australian makeup brands just to see what I thought about them. And I was like, oh, my gosh, you don't have to do that. But that's awesome. I've been dying to find, like, to try out makeup overseas and I meant to tell my friend Megan to like haul some stuff back for me and I'd like to to try because I've been like seriously dying to try something from overseas but I don't know anybody else but a couple of people so anyways she sent me some stuff from Australia to try so she wrote like a little postcard which is so sweet with like little koalas on it the classic australia thing so she lives in melbourne and she said that chi chi is a popular aussie brand i'm gonna like butcher this stuff but nateo is as well it's a more natural company i can tell australius is a popular drugstore brand okay so <clears throat> she sent me things from the three of them. So I'm just going to go over. Australia's is the popular drugstore brand. So this is the first thing she sent me. It's in the color Supernova Casanova. And it's called Double Decker. Um, it's an eyeshadow duo. Double Decker eyeshadow duo. So it looks like the top flips up. And it is like a brown cream product. A cream shadow. I'm just going to put that down on my hand. That's it like right there. It feels silky, um, like it's a base, but maybe not like a super, like the color tattoos from Maybelline. I'm just going to compare them to that. Like this blends out, so it just looks like it would be like a wash of color base before you put on the loose pigment that's in this bottom portion. Holy cannoli. This color, you can't even... It looks a little bit, I'm going to put it over that thing just to see. Maybe I should swatch them separate. Okay. That's it like over the thing and that's it on its own. It looks a little bit like Max Melon Pigment. I'm like really excited about this color. It's really pretty for the fall. Um, wow. Thank you so much, Simone. I love this. You did such a an awesome job at like picking out colors so I'm excited to try this out and see how it really works like in pairing it with the base <clears throat> I might also try and pair it with the similar base from the um, color tattoo and just see how that works as well like using the two of them together okay next up for the lipsticks I'm wearing one of them that she sent me she said that these are um, Nateo and N-A-T-I-O. I'm not saying it right, but <clears throat> she sent me two colors, and she said this is more of a natural brand, and the reason I said that I can tell is because they smell like soap. Um, there's, there is a really strong soapy smell. Like, even when I first put this lipstick, this is the color, and this is in the color Sweet, it's like a purpley mauve pink. I'm going to swatch it over here. When I first put it on my lips, it's really pretty. When I first put it on my lips, the smell was, and it just comes in these little black packaging plastic um, with a silver thing. So anyways, that's what it looks like. 
Um, the smell, when you first put it on your lips, is still smells. Like, very soapy smell. It almost tastes like soapy. But now that I've worn it, it kind of fades off. Now, I do have a little bit of <clears throat> Revlon's foiled lip gloss over this. So, um, it did change the color just in the center I put that on. But anyways, that's a really pretty color. I love it. She did a great job. And then she must know me so well because she got me a red. So I'm really excited. This is in the color Rush. And it just looks very... This one looks like it has more of a matte finish on it. That's the color Rush right there. Um, really nice. And yes, it smells almost like homemade soap. Like so I'm sure that that has something to do with it being the natural brand. I'm not sure. Chi Chi is the popular Australian brand, she said. So she sent me a quad. Choose Chi Chi Sophisticated Sassy Eyeshadow Quad. So this is what the box looks like. Um, I about died when I saw this because I'm like, oh, I love it. Look at this packaging. I don't want to blind you, but do you see this packaging? Oh, so pretty. Okay, so it says Chi Chi right here. <clears throat> and then you like push it in and it flips open. Oh my gosh, and it has like a huge mirror. These are so pretty. So this is in the color, I guess, Sophisticated Sassy. Okay, so these are the colors. Oh, yes, you saw it. Okay, I'm going to swatch them for the first time. I haven't swatched them yet. But those are the colors. <clears throat> okay, I'm going to bear down and do this. I'm going to do it on this hand. Hang on. Oh, that's like a matte gray. Whoa, these are super pigmented. This is like a sheeny, plummy brown. Oh. This is like a champagne-y color, a taupey champagne color. And then this is the highlight color right here. Oh. oh, those are so pretty. They're really pigmented and creamy. I like don't want to touch this because it's so shiny and beautiful. Okay, so those are the colors right here. The highlight, and then there's like a middle taupey shade, or a middle brownish almost like skin tone color and this like brownish purple color and then this dark gray <coughs> wow you did like a really awesome job Simone I love these colors I cannot wait to try this quad out and just give my thoughts on like how the eyeshadows blend and all that I'm gonna be sad if I like really love it because then it's like you know that holy grail thing you can only get overseas so anyways thank you so much people you guys are just awesome and you know you don't have to send me anything that's not what this video is about to be like oh look at all these people that sent me stuff you don't have to send me anything for me to appreciate it I appreciate all of the people who watch my videos and who comment below and you guys just say the sweetest things just your comments are so kind i just really appreciate you. i know it takes an extra second after you watch someone's video to comment and i just appreciate them so much the fact that you're watching my videos and that you're commenting and listening to me and um just the emails to my friend from my friends and just people who are watching I mean, just thank you so much. I cannot tell you how much I appreciate it. So I hope you all have a great day. This video finds you well, and I will see you in my next video. Mwah.